Hey now everybody, it's Aaron and welcome to this week's Market Minutes. If you are in the market for a new home, track the market to get a sense of value of your current home, or just love looking at houses as much as we do, you know this is the show for you. Let's do this. All right, before we jump in, we've got a really great new listing. It just came on today. Uh, 12709 Foundstone Road in Germantown. This is right around the corner from Wegmans. Got a really nice open floor plan here with a fireplace, great covered porch, open kitchen, all new stainless appliances. We just put all new flooring and uh, painted this place. It really looks great. Huge primary suite, two large closets, a large primary bath with separate tub and shower. Nice size second bedroom and hall bath, and then the all important home office or den. Best thing about this unit is it does have an interior stairwell down to your own private garage. That is super rare. And for $339.9, this is a real steal in a really great neighborhood in Germantown. If you know anybody who might be interested, please reach out. We'd love to show it to you. All right, sliding on down to Bethesda. This one caught my eye this morning. 4814 Earlston Drive in Crestview just came on the market at 950. Now, this is perfect if you're one of those, I really want to stay in D.C., uh, but I kind of wish I had Montgomery County Schools. This is the one for you. This is a really cute craftsman. This was totally redone in 2018. They call it a two bedroom, two bath, although there is another bedroom on the upper level. I think it probably doesn't have a closet and the ceiling might be a little low, which is why they're not calling it a third bedroom, but it's usable as such. Um, main level of this house, pretty much exactly like your typical row house uh, anywhere in DC. Got a nice living room up front, nice, good, large size dining space, and then a big long kitchen in the back. Goes out to a really great deck and good yard back there. Um, on the main level is your primary suite. Nice size primary bath. Love the dual vanities and the tile work in here. Nice secondary bedroom up front and another well done hall bath. Um, and then again, upstairs, you have that extra third room and uh, playroom. House doesn't have a basement. Um, but you know, a lot of DC row houses don't have usable basements. So I think this is a great alternative. If you're looking in DC at, uh, at nine fifty. I think it's the right number for everything that's been done on it. Um, and a really interesting play this week. Definitely check it out. Heading on up to Alta Vista. This is a house that's been sitting around for like 10 days now. And I do think it's sort of a sleeper. 5018 Alta Vista Road is listed at a million two. It's a four level split with four bedrooms, two full baths and a half bath. Check out this main level. They completely opened up this space. Got a really nice kitchen, dining and living area, all well sized in that main area. It's quite, you know, really can't get any more open than this. And then you've got fantastic screen porch off the back. Love that about the house, but what I really like more than that is you have two levels below this, both for hanging out and entertaining. Down one level from this main area, you have another large size sort of family room, rec room space, nicely done with the flooring, uh, has a uh, slider out to the backyard, gets really great light. Um, and then you have another level below that um, also finished in the same way. That's a great rec room. Um, I had clients, this sold in 2019. I had clients who uh, bid on it then, didn't get it. Uh, it sold in the nines a couple of years ago. Now they're asking one, two. I think it's high. Obviously it would have sold if it wasn't, but overall, I mean, the secondary bedrooms are a decent size. Third bedroom, a little small, but the hall bath is a great size. The primary bath is a great size. And it's got a decent yard. Um, overall, I think this there's a there's an opportunity here. Where the number is in this market, I don't know. But given that it's sitting there for 10 days, I, I would be aggressive on this and see where you can get it. I think it's a lot of space for somewhere between you know one one and one two. 
uh, hard to replicate in another neighborhood. So uh, I'm going to call this my hot deal of the week because I, I think it's sitting there uh, waiting for somebody to make a good run at it. Definitely check it out. All right, moving on up north to uh, North Bethesda. Uh, in Montrose Woods, which most people would know as Old Farm, um, we have 12103 Hitching Post Lane. Just came on the market a couple days ago at 885. Love the number on this. The house is in great condition, absolutely move in ready. Um, it is sort of a modified split. You do have your typical living room, kitchen, dining room sort of triangle on one level. Uh, down below, you get a nice rec room with a uh, French door out to the yard. And then upstairs from there, you've got three good sized bedrooms, nice size primary for the overall size of the house, um, and a good hall bath. Um, it's a 2,200 square foot house. It's not a huge house, but I think the big uh, upside to this is on that main level. The kitchen right now is very tucked away back in the corner. And you sort of access it via the dining room. If you were able to combine all those spaces um, and open it up more to the living room, I think uh, you could really get the flow everyone's looking for on that main level. And then you have a great family room down a couple steps below that. Um, it would make the house much more um, livable for today's buyer. And at 885, um, I think you could put that money in and see it back all day. So big fan of this house, like the yard, like the location. Um, I think if any houses are going to sell in multiples this weekend, I can pretty much guarantee it's going to be this one. All right, that's going to do it for this week. Thank you all for tuning in. Please give us a follow on social at Jeweler Burton. If you know anybody who's getting in the market or thinking about selling, please reach out. You know we'd really love to help. Have an awesome weekend, everyone. It looks like it's going to be really nice out. Later. Later.